girl welcome to this week's weekly vlog today is monday i finally filmed my review of the new makeup forever hd skin foundation which i literally really really love it i showed you guys that i did wear it in a couple vlogs and then i also wore it like on days where i was not vlogging to test it out for you guys so after testing it out probably like five times in the past week or so i decided to film the review on it let you guys know my thoughts on the foundation which you probably already saw it but in case you didn't see it yet i'll have it linked down below if i remember while i'm editing <laughs> this video what is on top of my head is that a light what is that um but yeah, I do love the foundation. I do wear it a little bit different than... I do apply it a little bit different than my other foundations. But once, um, but overall, I think it's a really beautiful foundation. So I am wearing it today. I also threw on a little ponytail extension. I'm going to turn it into a bun though because, because the ponytail part is not looking cute in the back of my head. I don't have any clips. So it's not looking the best. So I'm going to wrap it up into a bun so that way it could look presentable if I decide to go outside, which I think I am. Um, I might swing by Target, you know. <laughs> we might go to Target. I'm not sure. I am a little hungry. I haven't really eaten much besides coffee yet. So I'm a little hungry, so I might decide I might make something for like a snack. I don't know what yet, but um. I need to figure that out. And I also need to figure out dinner tonight, what we're going to make for dinner. Johnny, the kids are in school today and work. So it's just me. My mom is off today though. So she's upstairs. My dad's watching like soccer, the usual. Um, my dad watches soccer like 24 seven, by the way. Like that's his favorite thing to do. Also actually need to plan out another video that I'm working with a brand on. So I need to plan that out and make sure I have everything in line i decided that i wanted to get my hair braided y'all but the person that i want to braid it only has one appointment left and i cannot take that appointment because clay has tutoring at that time so i'm literally like Ugh, i wish i'm like stalking her page to see if she has any openings any cancellations because i want to get my hair braided um just like straight back braids uh, but like I want her to do like a design on one of the sides like a little heart thingy that's been like really trendy and I think it's really cute so I kind of want to try that um, just to give myself a break for like a week or week and a half because they're not going to last that long I already know like braids don't last long on me like straight back braids do not last that long on me so um, yeah I really wish someone would cancel so I could get a spot <laughs> because uh, I want to get my hair done I do want to get another treatment as well like keratin or something like that but I want to do the braids first so that way my hair is natural at the roots so it's easier to like grip um the braids when my hair is like more silky if it's like relaxed or it has a keratin it's not gonna hold the braid as good it's not gonna you know all right let's go to the kitchen okay y'all so I just made myself a little snack it is crackers ribs and cheese i use the crix crackers these here these are just like caribbean crackers um grapes and i use this cheese from trader joe's it's the um just cheddar cheese i guess so i'm gonna have this for a snack and see what else i need to be doing for today <laughs> hey y'all so it's a lot later it is now like five six o'clock no it's five o'clock four it's like 4 50 ish i'm about to unbox something i got from rare beauties so i figured i'll show you guys what i got johnny's home the kids are home everyone's home now so everyone's home sorry about all the sniffling i feel like i feel like i keep sniffling so i'm about to open up this package i have no idea what's in here sometimes i kind of have a idea of what may be in a package based on what i see is like new but i don't think i've seen anything new from rare beauty so so yeah i don't think i've seen anything new from rare beauty besides like the powders which i have um okay so they sent oh okay so they sent over some cheek products these are not new i don't think it basically is a, a it's a cheek combo basically like the highlighter and a blush i love their blushes and i definitely love their highlighter and reflect it's my favorite liquid highlighter they sent one 
I love it. It's so pretty. Reflect is that girl. Like that's the highlighter that I use the most recently. Like in the past six months, I use that one the most. That and my Laura Mercier Light Catcher Powder have been my go-to for highlighter for like a while um so yeah i love those two and reflect is definitely that girl they also sent me captivate which i don't know what that one looks like because i don't own it so i'm excited to see that and then for blush they sent love which do i have love i think i do i think love is the one that i have and i really love it and they also sent one called encourage so this is the cute little um package here i find that a lot of their packaging is reusable so like the little things they send me i tend to use them i'm definitely going to use this for something it's going to be probably in one of my purses because it's really nice and you can use it for so many different things like just carrying little essentials or whatever like i like to separate my bag let's see what captivate looks like i'm very curious oh this looks pretty how come i don't have this this is Captivate, you guys. I, for some reason, I thought Reflect was the only color that looked like this. I'm so confused. Wait a minute. I thought Reflect was the only color that was like this, but apparently they have another color that would be beautiful on my complexion. What rug have I been under? Okay, so this is Reflect that I love and know. It's amazing. And this is Captivate. They are very similar. Captivate is definitely a little bit more coppery. And then Reflect is more bronzy. This is Love, which I think I have this one. Yeah, I have this one. It's a really pretty color. Love. It's a matte blush. Really, really pretty. Then I have Encourage, which I don't have Encourage. I have another blush, I think. But it's like a plum color oh this one looks really pretty as well so this is encourage thank you to rare beauty for sending these goodies over i definitely cannot wait to try the ones i haven't tried yet Let's put these away y'all i still don't know what's for dinner and it's definitely like time for dinner the kids are fine because they don't typically eat what we eat anyway so like their dinner is kind of predictable because they only eat like five things so i already know what they're gonna have pretty much it's just for johnny and i i don't really know what we're gonna do i also kind of want to run some errands so i'm trying to decide if i should go with him run my errands while he's in there and then um just pick him up after and head home so yeah i'm trying to decide what i'm gonna do with my time i'm trying to decide like how to organize my time best because um he's there for two hours so i'm gonna have some time to kind of like you know get my life together hey y'all so we're about to head out to go to clay tutoring i'm bringing my bag so i can get some work done johnny's also gonna do some work so i just dropped clay off at tutoring and i'm about to go to marshall's I'm about to go into I'm about to go to Marshall's. Johnny is already at Panera. Sorry, I'm making all this noise. I'm so sorry. I'm gonna get a couple outfits for Cali if I can find some at Marshall's. Hey y'all, so we are back home. I wanted to show you guys what I picked up from the grocery store. I just got some school snacks because we needed some more. So I got these bars. Kelly likes these. Um, they look rice. They're like Rice Krispies, but strawberry. Um, got some coconut water. I want to make some smoothies. So I got that. I got some of uh, Uncle Matt's lemonade. These are like healthier juices they don't add any sugar so it's just the lemon and strawberry in here it's pretty pricey but everything healthy is a little pricier <laughs> 
Um, got some juice boxes for the kids. And I got two things of chicken. One is chicken breast and one is chicken thighs. So those are for dinner tomorrow. Well, one of them is for dinner tomorrow. The other one is probably for the next day. I got paper towel because I just needed some. So I just got one roll because I usually get that at um, in bulk. So yeah. I got this. This is super random. But I saw they had edible flowers and I thought maybe I can make a nice drink or a gourmet meal. <laughs> so unnecessary but they looked cute so I, was, I wanted to try it i picked up some dates these i use sometimes in my smoothies if i want like a little bit of a sweeter taste so i got dates i got some spinach i got a cucumber this is a long cucumber um i got some more creamer i actually really like the nut pod so i picked up one of these um some more school snacks for the kiddos i got some soup this is where i went it's called a matter of health it's in um manuet in rockland if you live in rockland um so yeah it's really good it has like a lot of healthy stuff it's like a mini whole foods i like to say it has a lot of healthy options it's pretty much like a healthy um grocery store i got some lemons three lemons i got three green apples over here i got some ginger and i also got turmeric um these are both for smoothies and cooking so that's what i got and then i got this because i was hungry but then i ended up going to panera so i didn't even eat it but it's like a caramel and peanut butter peanut bar i don't know if it's gonna taste good but we'll see it says it has milk chocolate it has nougat and caramel and peanuts so sounds pretty good Hook a healthier snicker bar i feel like so yeah we'll try it out and see if it's good or not i got this soup mainly because i feel like it'll be good for lunch for work when i go in on wednesday so that's why i got this soup so i'm just gonna pack my bag real quick i have a tripod in the middle of my living room because i was filming so i'm just gonna pack what's in here a ton of like lip stuff car keys i don't know where oh that's a bad idea um i have not i lost my house keys i don't know where i put them i need to find them like it's actually not a good thing so I need to look for my house keys. This is the lip gloss I'm wearing today. It's from Lancome. Man, I have three lashes left. This is horrendous. <laughs> I want to get my lashes done so badly, but my lash lady is so far away. I need to find someone closer. Anyways, I found these in my bag. <laughs> so I'm going to eat some eating these. Uh, it's like a trail mix, I guess. I got it like I actually got this like a month ago but I never ate it I guess but it's pretty good all right so I just got to my first stop I'm gonna go to anthropology to get some candles hey y'all so i just got in from anthropology i didn't really find what i wanted um i was trying to get some candles i got one candle but i wanted to get more they only had like the scent that i like they only had it in one color jar that i wanted like basically they make different color jars of the same scent but they only had it in black and the other colors were just like not i was not a fan of um there was one they had like a wooden cover which i really loved but they didn't have it in a neutral color they had it like in like a mauve or in like a like a red and a blue i wanted like a neutral you know i stopped at william sonoma to try to get some bakeware and they didn't have anything that i wanted so basically i didn't have anything i wanted so i'm gonna go to cran barrel which i should have just went there in the first place <laughs> i wasted time i also wanted to grab cali some 
clothes because she needed some newer outfits. Her clothes are getting too small for her. Lately, she's had a little bit of a growth spurt. Go so. past this light. Then at the next one, turn left. So we just got to Crate and Barrel. And I'm going to go in, grab some stuff, and run out. <laughs> Alright y'all, so I got Kelly some stuff at The Gap. They had quite a bit of things in their sale section because they were getting rid of it for the season, I guess. But thankfully they had stuff to choose from. So I got her quite a few outfits, well, um, mostly tops and then some bottoms as well. I'm gonna head home now. Um, I kinda want a snack, so I think I'm gonna grab some sushi and then I'm gonna head home so I can cook dinner so the sushi will be like my lunch i guess so i got some sushi i'm about to eat it right now and i only have chopsticks because that's all they had i don't even know how to use chopsticks oh gosh Y'all, I am back home. I am so tired. I've been on go all day. I was filming this morning. Then I started vlogging, went to the mall. I mean, went to the shops and back home. So I'm about to show you guys what I picked up. And then I'm going to start preparing dinner. Dinner's going to be pretty quick and easy. So, well, I don't know about quick, but it's going to be easy. So let me just show you guys what I got real quick. And then we can... Head to the kitchen and start preparing dinner. So I got a couple things at Anthropology. I thought they were cute. This is a pink one and then a white one. So I got those. And I, fig I figure it both Callie and I could wear these. I got this candle. So I always buy this candle. It's my favorite. And um, I have it in all different um jar styles so right now i have a gold one a white one and another like cream color one so i wanted new colors um so like i said earlier they only had a black and then they had like some other colors that just didn't really go with the theme of my home so i felt like the black was the best so i'm gonna be putting the black on the the um the TV stand right there. I probably will get another black. Honestly, I like. Honestly, the black looks really nice. I should have picked two of these up. That way, I can have one for the bathroom, because the black would go with the bathroom as well. So, yeah, I got the black. So that's what I got at Anthro. And then I went to Crate and Barrel, and the bags are all the way over there. Then I picked this up. One of you guys messaged me on Instagram um, and said that you tried this and it really helped with PCOS. So you guys know I have PCOS and thank you so much for recommending this product to me. I don't want to put your name on blast, but I am so thankful. Um, she DM'd me a picture of this and told me it was working for her. So I definitely wanted to try it out. And while I was at the Whole Foods store, I actually only went in there to get sushi, but then I said, wait a minute, they may have this in here. And she had DM'd me earlier today. So when I saw, so I looked and they had it. So I picked it up. I'm going to try it. I'm going to start it today. This one has 60 capsules of this um, supplement. And I also picked this up. This is Omega 7. I heard it's really good for like hydration. Um, so I'm going to try it out. It's good for like healthy skin, healthy hair just have been really nice like hydrated membranes so yeah got this to try out as well super random but wanted to try it and then I went to the gap for Cali oh I didn't show you guys but I got this at the health food store as well this was my 
drink. I want to drink a little bit of it. Anyway, so we went to the Gap to get Callie stuff because, like I said, she needed some new clothes or whatever. She needed some new clothes. I put my sunglasses in here. Um, so the first thing I got was this sweater. It's really nice and cozy. Pink and it has an orange zipper. It's from the Gap. Well, everything's from the Gap for Callie. So this one I got, I got a size 10. I figured it would be like a little oversized, but I think it'll look really nice for her. So I'm just going to put her stuff on here. And then I got these pants. These are super soft. And I picked up these pants. Also same material, like really cozy, but it's in pink. Picked up. These were not on sale, but I thought they would look really nice. I thought that she could wear them with some of the other things that I got. I always get her leggings, so got these. Then I picked this up, and I thought the leggings would go really well with this sweater. And this sweater looks really nice. It was also part of the sale, $34, 50% off of that, so like $17. Um, really nice. Then I got her this one. This is like a longer sweater and $20, so $10 for this. And I thought it was a good deal. Like, what? This is perfect for even, you know, they're going to have to wear green probably for St. Patrick's Day. So this is like a nice, chunky, um, it's like a sweater dress, but she'll probably wear leggings with it. So because she's not a big fan of dresses. <laughs> um, and then I got this sweater. This one looks really nice. It's like sparkly silver and it's a really nice fit. I think it's going to fit really nice as well. And then lastly, lastly, I got this um, cheetah print top. I thought it was really nice. It has the little frills at the end, like the lettuce the, um, detail. It's like a thermal almost, but also has it on the sleeves. So I thought this was really, really nice. So that's Callie's haul. All right, y'all. So I am still waiting on my table. It has not arrived. So we still have the old table in here. Got some glasses and then I got some stuff to like bake with. So I got these glasses, which I thought looked really nice. I've been eyeing these for a minute, and they have they were actually out of stock for a little while, but they're back in stock. So I picked um, two of these. These I feel like these will be good for like juices or even like a little like margarita or something like that, like just little beverages. I think this would be great for, they're pretty sturdy and you know, they have some weight to them, which is nice. They're not flimsy. So I love the detail. Um, love the detailing on the, they match these, which they're a different store, but they're like the same store kind of, like they're sister stores. I got these so basically they're just a bigger version of the other ones this I think will be good for like coffee or something where you want more volume so maybe like water coffee yeah got two of these as well cheers got a couple all right then I got some stuff to bake and cook with so I picked up this uh, set. It's a ready. It's called this. Uh, it's called oven to table. I think. Basically, you can bake with this in the oven up to 400 degrees, and then it comes with this um, holder where you can just put it on the table. Wait a minute. <laughs> okay, this is for the other one. One second, y'all. One second. <laughs> This one is the right one here. So basically you put this on the table and then this just fits right in there. And you, it's like a pot holder basically, I guess. If you're, it's like a pot holder for when your pot is hot and you don't want it on the table directly. So I thought this was really nice and I needed um, pot holders. I also needed dishware to bake with. So I figured I would just get this set because it looks really nice and it's like two birds with one stone. So I got this one for like vegetables and just anything that's more flat that I would be baking or cooking. I got this one for like, you know, things that are going to be deeper, like um, chicken or like a lasagna or something that is basically like deeper. So I got this one and this one comes with one of these as well. So basically you just sit it right in here 
and it sits perfectly and you can just put it right on the table so yeah I'm gonna wash these because I am gonna use one of them today um, for chicken and yeah I'm gonna get to cooking basically because that's what we need to do right now <laughs> okay so I'm making a one pot dish today I'm gonna do chicken and potatoes all in one dish I'm gonna use this dish right here so right now I'm preheating the oven and then I'm gonna just season the chicken chop the potatoes up and just put everything all together to make one meal so it should be should be pretty easy So this is what it looks like with the potatoes and the chicken. I'm just going to go ahead and put it in the oven for 45 minutes and then it should be done around that time. So I'm going to pop it in. Just got a PR package from Summer Fridays. Not sure what's in here, but I'm really excited. Yes, my pants are open. Don't judge me. <laughs> okay. It says drenched in Oasis, squalene, uh, glycerin and skin common blend i guess this is like an oil i'm assuming or like some type of for sure an oil or some type of moisturizer um summer friday's dream oasis deep hydration serum oh it's a serum this sounds really good so this is it here thank you summer fridays for sending this over i definitely i definitely i definitely cannot wait to try it um Sounds like it's gonna be really good. I've heard really good things about squalene. I think it's like good for hydration um, and then also like the moisture barrier and I know glycerin is really good. So I like the skin common benefits as well because my skin gets irritated so easily. So we love a skin common product. Yeah, definitely can't wait to try this. I'll show you guys the pack with the uh, bottle. Let's see what the bottle looks like because I've never seen this. Oh, it's a little cute package. This looks really nice. This is going to be really pretty in my bathroom. In my little vanity. I'll give you a hint. I'm on the tree. Well, hey guys, today is uh, um. Wednesday I am in Starbucks drive through about to get my drink um, oh there's a new drink I want to try it today so that's what I'm up to I wanted to get a little picture the drink I'm trying is called the toasted vanilla um, toasted vanilla shake and espresso I think it's gonna be similar to the brown sugar oat milk shake and espresso which I've been literally obsessed with so um i'm excited to try it one of you guys tagged me on it and uh, shout out to you because i didn't even know it was happening i don't know how i missed it but i definitely missed it so i'm excited to try it it's 140 calories for the grande which is not bad um at all so yeah excited let me go into starbucks app real quick so i can pay for this thank you you too thank you hmm it's nice it's definitely a very similar experience but the flavor is a little different which ones are I like better Right now, I will say I think I like the brown sugar one better. But this one's also really nice. I'm going to try it again. Mm. I'll let you guys know later once I finish this. But right now, I feel like I do like the taste. But it's pretty good though. Right now, I'm going to say it's a tie. It's a tie for now. 
So I just got to the, the hair salon. I cannot wait to get my hair done. Like, ooh, it's just been long overdue. Um, I am going to try to edit a video while I'm in there. I don't know if I'm going to be able to, but I'm going to attempt to edit a video. I've been taking these. I took these last night and I took these twice today. No, I took it once today um, after lunch. And I feel like they're working. It's only been one day. It hasn't even been a full day, 24 hours. It's been like 12 hours. I don't know. But I feel like they are working so far. So yeah, my appetite seems to be a little bit curbed more than usual. Hey y'all, so I got my hair done yesterday. Today's Thursday. Um, hey y'all, today's Thursday. I didn't really record the rest of yesterday. I got my hair done, went home, and pretty much did nothing. Um, so yeah, that's what my hair looks like. I ended up getting a keratin because the hairdresser told me that I could get it. It's fine. So good keratin i am out with clay we are about to go to bath and body works to grab some candles and um from there we're probably gonna get lunch um that's what i'm doing it's like 2 30 right now it's like 2 30 ish in the afternoon clay and i are about to go to bath and body works to try to grab some candles it is kind of cold outside today i was not expecting this weather can you please enter the password? Here. Hey y'all, so I just got to the mall. I'm about to head into Dick's. I need to get Clay some sneakers. Um, not me recording this, somebody walking by. So embarrassing. I'm gonna get Clay some sneakers. But we also swing by Zara. It may be a little too late to head there because Zara gets really packed. But maybe we will and see what's up in Zara. So let's go. Anyways, it's so windy. I don't know why. <laughs> Hey y'all, so I'm back home. I stopped at the grocery store amongst other things. So I'll show you guys what I got there real quick um, since I'm already in the kitchen. So I just picked up a chicken for dinner. This is just a pre-cooked chicken and we're gonna have it with rice and beans. I got this pure pineapple juice. Pure pineapple juice, it doesn't have any other added ingredients. So just pineapple. Um, then I picked this up for soda. It's like a pink ginger soda. I got some cookie dough. Sweet Lawrence. It's pretty good. What's that on the counter? Is that like... I don't know what that is. <laughs> Let's clean that. Um, I got some apple juice. I got some soup for work. I'm going to go to work tomorrow, so I figured I'd get some soup. For work and then I got another juice I got this one blueberry pomegranate pomegranate so those are so that's my little grocery Woo! so that's my mini haul from the grocery store I did get a lot of I did get some more things so I'll show you guys what I got as well I also got some things from Zara so I'll show you guys that okay so I started cooking some rice in the pressure in the pressure cooker because I wanted to make the rice for the chicken so this is it here I'll show you guys what we got at Bath and Body Works real quick um, picked up candles I haven't picked up a Bath and Body Works candle in a minute but I went in there and these smell really good this first one is called Endless Weekend. It smells delicious. Let me remind myself. Mmm, it smells really good. So this one is Fresh Summer Mandarin, Sunkissed Magnolia, and Blue Coconut Water. 
I also like the packaging on this because it's very like minimal and simple. This one I thought was really nice packaging as well. It's called Fiji, Fiji White Sands and um, it smells really nice. Mmm, this is a really beautiful one. So got that. It's more like summery. Definitely has some coconut to it. Um, does it describe it anywhere? Yeah, it has sugarcane, nectarine, sandalwood. Okay, it doesn't mention coconut at all, but it smells really good. And then the last one, the similar packaging to the first one. I really like the sleek look. It looks very like modern and, you know, it goes with my aesthetic. This one is called Dark Amber Oud. And Oud, it has um, golden amber, rainwater, and Oud wood. And this one smells really good. It's almost masculine, but still really nice and um, luxury. I don't know. It smells really good. I wish they had a sale, but they didn't. So I'm going to need to monitor their sale so that way I can get these when they're on that special that they always have. We went to American Eagle because we always wear <laughs> that one pair of mom jeans. So we picked up two more. So this is literally the same jean except it has no um, holes basically. So this is the mom jean. Wait, what does it say it on here? This is the mom jean stretch. Actually, it has to say stretch, the one that I like because it has stretch to it. So it's able to fit your curves really well. And I get regular, 14 regular for these. Um, this I can get 12 as well, but I want it to not be super tight. I want it to have that relaxed fit. Um, so it's like, you know, more like a mom jean. So, and then I got a white one. They had, ooh, <laughs> they had white and I haven't bought white jeans in so long, but I got the same exact one. They basically stretch. Um, and this one, this one is, um, also regular, 14 and regular. And this one has the stress in, so it has like the holes right here and right there. And the gap bag is still on the floor. Yep, it's still there. <laughs> so I got that. And then from Zara, I'm going to do a haul, but I'll do a little sneak peek of what I got. I need to try everything to see if they fit. Um, but I guess I'll show you guys the perfume because that's not really like part of a try on haul but I picked this up this smells really good it's called Wander Rose and they had a lot of fragrances out I guess like the newer ones and just they were stocked because usually my Zara is out of stock of everything so this is the bottle here and like I said it smells so delicious like it smells like summertime for sure and I'm not usually a big rose fan but this rose smells really pretty so I think they have some other like fruity stuff in here, which makes it smell really good to me. So got this. Those are my purchases that I'm going to show you guys. Um, the Zara stuff, I will do a haul most likely. So you guys will see that in the haul. I need to try everything on as well to make sure they fit. Cause Zara had their fitting rooms closed, so I could not try the clothes on in the store. Good morning. Today is Saturday. I haven't vlogged since I think Thursday. I don't even know what day it was but today is saturday um i am warming i am feeling very cozy in my sweater it is kind of chilly this morning um the weather has just been up and down like really badly but it is kind of chilly about to make some coffee i just got up you know brushed my teeth did my hair a bit did my hair <laughs> um i think i told you guys but i got a keratin treatment yesterday uh two days ago Wait, when did I get the keratin? I got the keratin on Tuesday, Thursday. I got keratin done on Wednesday, I believe. Um, so yeah, Wednesday afternoon. So um, today's Saturday, it's been Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. It's been the three days, so I can finally kind of style it however I want. Hair just feels a lot healthier. And at first it looked like the color had went away, the black, but it came back. I don't know what happened, but it looks like it got black again. So I don't know what that was about. Maybe the keratin like settled or something. I have no idea. But anyways, um, I'm gonna make myself some coffee. Yesterday after work, I dropped Clay off at Tutorin and while he was there, I ended up going and running some errands. Um, 
so I stopped at the mall I stopped at um, the vitamin uh, I stopped at the mall I got some supplements because I want to get back into the gym and back into like my routine of like you know working out and protein all that stuff so um, I got some stuff for that and I also picked up some stuff at home goods show you guys what I got um, and I also went back to Zara I picked up a couple other things because I'm just gonna do a Zara haul at the end of this week or next week I think yeah yeah I wanted to have like at least 10 items to show you guys so I wanted to get a couple more things um, I don't even know if I have 10 items, but I picked out what I loved the most. There were a couple things that did not have my size in, so I wasn't able to get them. But I'm excited about what I got, so I'll show you guys those for sure, because I definitely cannot wait to wear them out, take pictures. I think there are some really nice pieces, and I have a color scheme, apparently, for spring. Not, I didn't choose it, I just kind of liked the pieces that they had in those colors. So I kind of have like a color scheme that's going to be happening for spring, I guess. Let me go to the kitchen, make some coffee. Johnny's already in there. He already made his coffee. Um, I sprayed on perfume today because this morning I was just like, I woke up, I was so cold and just not with it. I was like, you know what? I'm going to put on a sweater. I'm going to spray some perfume on. So I'm wearing Gucci Guilty today. Um, so one of my winter favorites. And my lips are feeling ashy. So I'm going to put some... Chapstick on. All right, y'all. So I'm gonna show you guys what I picked up at um, the vitamin shop and Marshalls real quick. So I picked up some new energy drinks. This is the Alani new one, and they have a collab with Addison Ray. Oh, they have a collab here. So it's called Berry Pop. I've never tried this one, but it looks good. So I'm pretty sure it's gonna taste good. Most of their stuff tastes really good. Um, I also picked up some protein powder from um, Women's Best. I just got vanilla because I'm probably going to make a smoothie out of it when I'm done with the gym for like my lunch. I'm thinking I'm going to go to the gym like three days a week. Um, and then I got some BCAAs. These are good if you want like quick muscle recovery. Um, I find that I don't have as much muscle pain when I, when I used to use this, like when I used to be really, really into the gym <laughs> years ago. Um, these definitely help you recover faster. Got some snacks. These taste really good. Uh, got some new gloves because mine are dingy and missing. I'm missing one side. And then I got lashes at Target because I could not secure a lash appointment. So I got some lashes. I don't know if, um, I've been kind of wanting to try a lash lady that's a little bit more local to me. But I just don't know if I... I'm just a little nervous, I guess, because when once you get your lashes done, like you have to leave them in for a month, unless you like take them out, but then that could be really damaging to your regular lash. And that's what I picked up at Vitamin Shop and Marshalls for the gloves. Um, I'm excited to get back into working out and stuff like that. So I'm gonna like look up a little plan so I can do it. But yeah, that's what I got. So I'm gonna drink my coffee. Oh, by the way, I got these at Home Goods last night as well. I got these um, table mats. I also got this table runner and this tablecloth at Home Goods. So, yeah. I think I'm going to plan out what I'm going to do and then maybe we can maybe go to Target and then come back and do a lot of cleaning. Oh my gosh, I need to edit a video. No. Oh no. Oh. Okay. So, all right. So scratch that. Um, all right. I definitely need to try to edit this video today. I don't know how and when I'm going to do that. You know what? I'm going to start that. 
Okay, it's 11 o'clock already. I probably should start that right now. I forgot, I had to edit this video. BRB. 